Hello YouTubers in YouTube land. Uh, today I'm doing an unpackaging video of some product that I was given from uh, Synopsis Bearings just to test out and whatnot because I asked online in, in an email to see if uh, I can test some of the bearings and different you know, um, challenges and just to promote their bearings and stuff. So I'm going to show you how I'm going to open this. It's going to be amazing. Uh, genius idea, genius level. So, yeah, let's see if it works. This is, uh, I want to see what's in here. I'm not sure what's in here. So, here we go. And I picked this spot because it's, uh, it's a good skate area. It's obviously good to skate on. You can see all the wax marks. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Look at this. It actually ripped open. I ripped it open with one with one fell throw. So as you can see there is there's a synopsis skate DVD I guess. It's kind of a shorter one probably. It's got five main skaters. Akeem Haynes. Gustavo Morales, Mark Nicholson, Mike Jim, and Jim Bates. So, you know, I'm gonna check uh, check this out. Maybe showcase some more uh, footage coming up. And yeah, it's a teaser promo. It's not like a full length skate video, but still, it's uh, better than nothing, so to speak, right? Just trying to handle this stuff carefully. Uh, so right here. There's a picture of a guy. Who's this again? Does it say? Um, anyways, he's doing a backside nose blunt slide. I want to see. Make sure it looks good. Yeah, look at that. Back nose blunt. So, that's cool. Little, uh, extra with the packaging and then there's a bunch of stickers which I will put somewhere very soon and actually I'll put one I'll put one down right now so you just gotta peel these stickers are very fancy they have a little cut down the side so you can just peel it very easily. Uh, so, very easy. very rotund guy in the background making a feature in this video. I just chose this spot because it's very uh, cool, it's uh, a good skate spot, it's very, you know, it's quiet so you can hear me speak. And so here in this package there's ABEX 7 Blu-rays they're called. Preci precision machine bearings and so I don't think these ones are ceramic but they're very fancy. And yeah, I'm gonna feature more of the setup and also testing uh, the distance traveled going down a hill with the same skateboard. So no two different boards. I'm gonna do a test with uh, my current board and then switch the bearings and then see, you know, what what rolls better, what rolls farther, easier, smoother, and is better for skateboarding. You know, especially for doing transition and full skateboarding you want to have those bearings that just like zoom you know you can skate super fast you know that's what you want you want very very frictionless kind of uh, bearings so 
yeah, I'm very hyped on this. Uh, any little thing helps, you know. Keeps you going. Keeps you, you know, wanting to strive more to you know, bang out some some bangers as they as they're called, and you know, get some runs, some good technical tricks happening. So, yeah. And now I'm gonna skate a little bit. I'm gonna enjoy this little ledge. Maybe do one or two tricks, and then I got a pretty busy, busy schedule, so there'll be more to come. All right, so let me see how I look. Just gotta flip the camera. All right, looking pretty decent. So yeah, I'm up here on the top of the Central City Mall parking lot, and this is the fourth floor. As you can see right here, it says four, and you can actually drive up. I think it's at least one more floor up to. So there's five, six. I think it's like the six levels total. But anyways, so this is me showing you guys how good my wheels and, or I should say, how good my bearings are uh, as I roll down. I'm gonna push maybe twice, or I'm thinking once or twice will be a good standard to set for the next time I come around with the uh, new synopsis bearings to test those. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to loop right around to the right side and then loop around, loop around, and then at the very end I'm going to go left. And then I'm going to see how far that I roll with this current setup. As you can see my bearings are pretty fairly dirty, fairly dirty, although because they're worn in and they're used a lot, they still roll fairly well. So, but the thing is the grittiness of the, of all the sand and dirt particulate may slow down the, you know, the rolling uh, smoothness, so to speak, and the uh, kind of range that you get with each push. That's what I'm wanting to figure out is what, what bearings roll the best, you know, and if Synopsis is a really good, um, you know, brand, I'm going to prove it. You know, and uphold it and promote it to the best of my ability. So, and do some more like uh, maybe downhill, uh, fast skateboarding and stuff like that. Because I've always been into like street and say like I just seen these cool uh, parking meters to skate on one up. But I'm gonna switch it up a little bit. So here we go. I'm gonna give. I'm gonna push once, starting from this stop. Uh, stop see if the line says stop you know you do you start <laughs> that's how my mind works okay no it's good okay one push though here we go down two floors. <laughs> let's, let's try this again. Uh, I'll see if I can make it down to the bottom floor without having to push a second time.
roll to the second line from that wall. So the second parking line. So I'm going to see you tomorrow, come back with a different set of bearings and test that. See how uh, synopsis works out for uh, downhill, downhill cruising and the, the range potential, the range uh, mean or average, you know, that's what I'm wanting to find out, so I'm, I'm excited.